Uh, my name is Louis Gong. I'm a Nooksack tribal member and I'm the owner of 8th Generation. People have followed my organic development as an artist uh, from you know, 10 or 12 years ago when I first started. So it's hard for people to imagine uh, what 8th Generation is now. So we not only have this beautiful store at Pike Place Market, we also have a studio where we're making the phone cases um, and the other things we make here in the studio, and then also shipping out our blankets to people all over the world. I'm really proud of the scale that we've achieved. I think the instinct that the general population has when thinking about a native-owned business is to think about us as being really small and struggling. Um, the next thing we're looking to do is open up a second store in Portland. I grew up in a house with no running water. So right now, being the owner of one of the fastest growing privately owned native companies in the United States or Canada is amazing to me. And I started off just drawing on shoes and I recognized that wasn't a good way to make a living. So I started teaching myself how to make products. And over time, I started teaching other staff people how to do it. And so now what happens at eighth generation is the design work happens upstairs. And then downstairs, we have native people who came to 8th generation without any information about how to do art, how to operate uh, a laser or UV printer, or how to work with Adobe Illustrator, actually making the products with skills that they've learned here on the job. I'm so excited about native entrepreneurship because I think more and more native people are recognizing that what we bring to the table, you know, the things that we've inherited from our grandmas and grandpas, whether it's our art or the way that we look at the world, is not just valuable beyond the boundaries of our reservations and our communities, it's needed. If you look at where we've come in the short period of time that we've been doing this um, and extrapolate where we might be 10 years from now, it's very exciting. I'm constantly conspiring with a group of young native people on what moves to make next. I've never done this before. None of our staff have done this before. I think a lot of what we're doing is largely unprecedented in Indian country. And so it takes a lot of courage to make each move, but I'm able to do so with confidence because I'm really proud of the team that we have here at 8th Generation. This is native people kicking ass all day long here at 8th Generation and I'm super proud of that.